to get your mobile RC app running, you need um, an Arduino, a Bluetooth module, and some sort of servos and electronic speed controllers, and also power supply. So first, install um, the sketch from our website to your Arduino. Connect it with um, the Arduino with the Bluetooth module. And also be sure that the Arduino get uh, some power from uh, the battery or somewhere else. In this case, it's an electronic speed controller. We support the 5 volt. Um, so then, um, then you can also install your servos or electronic speed controllers to the PWM output of your Arduino. So after that, you have a ready setup, and you can get your smartphone. So here we are. To test this, uh, you can download for free the Simple RC app and download the Bluetooth module with your phone, and then you can connect from the Simple. RC uh, to the setup and you can see a little bit hardly in this video because of the resolution and um, yeah but you can see the like right and left server is um, moving if I touch the control on the app so if this all works together we can switch to the mobile RC app So it's very similar, it has two modes for operation. It's the control center mode, you can see it first, with the controls, left and right. And you can switch to the vehicle mode, there, in the upper uh, left. So this is the mode uh, for operation on the vehicle. You can get uh, another smartphone with the mobile RC App running and now we have on the right mobile the control center mode and the left mobile the vehicle mode on the setup menu you will install your um, with the information of your server and also the port and the identifier in uh, to get both to connect each other so you request your identifier from our server. You simply can put your email address for that. So you get your email um, registration link and also the identifier to put it in there to the settings menu. After that you have both apps um, After that, you have both apps ready to connect to each other. You should connect it um, with the connect button within five seconds to get a successful connection from the one to the other. So the connection process may take a little bit because um, it has all the possibilities to uh, connect the both smartphones together. Preferred uh, direct connection, but if this does not work, it connect to uh, over a proxy server. In the meantime, um, I have to say, be sure also to set up on the vehicle mode smartphone the proper um, Bluetooth module to connect it afterwards to the Arduino. So now we are connected. You see the live preview on the control center smartphone on the right on the vehicle mode, um, which sends the live preview to the control center smartphone on the right. So now I connect on the Bluetooth module with the uh, vehicle mode smartphone 
And now, maybe you can see, I can control on the control on the smartphone, see the servers on uh, the, the top. And another option I have in this mode is um, to get a picture simply to, uh, with touching the live preview. And now the picture is on the vehicle mode, smartphone on the left, stored. Let's see. We will switch to a um, folder view. There is the image um, taken. Yeah, there is it. So the possibility is with the mobile RC app is to take pictures remotely, to have a um, live preview, and to control the uh, servos and electronic speed controllers with the uh, Arduino. Yeah, have fun with it.